as a defensive coach, they're the games you enjoy the most? Uh, look, yeah, I, I think we've been quite strong throughout the first three games in the pre-season defensively. Uh, haven't got, hadn't had the results until today, but uh, on the back of the strategy, on the back of uh, you know, what we went in with, the way the players trained throughout the week, uh, it was nice to see them uh, actually uh, implement it for the full 80 minutes and uh, defensively, uh, even at the end there for the last five, six minutes, although uh, everyone's on the edge of their seat, yeah. uh, yeah, we, we, uh, we solved everything they threw at us and, uh, yeah, and it went a long way for us to win today. How confident are you in those dying stages, knowing, obviously knowing what you know about what the boys have got to be doing in defence, how confident are you in those moments? Well, I'm confident because of the boys for the last 17, 18 weeks, plus the you know, half a dozen games we've played, have shown nothing but uh, you know, good intent. Yeah, their mindset's been really good. Uh, and as I said, like uh, the, the first two games, like defensively, we were quite strong. You know, uh, we had our moments, but uh, today was kind of a combination of the first two weeks and the trials to where it all came together. And, uh, you know, and uh, not only am I proud, but the boys should be proud. And now that they've shown that they can do it for a full 80 minutes, that's kind of the bar that they've set now for themselves. How much of it is mental in those final stages in particular, but how much of defence is mental? Well, it's all mental. Yeah, it's all attitude. You'll find that in all sports, all good successful sides uh, build, you know, build their success on the back of defence. And uh, you know, this club has been a powerhouse for a long time on the back of that. We're trying to get our way back. We're trying to uh, uh, make this side about us. And uh, today, tonight goes to uh, a long way for the vindication of what the hard work that they've put in throughout the last 20 weeks. What was Jordan's message at full time to the team? Ah, uh, well, look, he, he, he was uh, obviously very, very happy. Uh, I think if, uh, it, was, it was just more so that he was very pleased that you know, things that we did throughout the game, uh, throughout the week, actually was transferred into the game. Our game plan was pretty, uh, pretty simple, but you still got to execute it, and you've got an opposition that are trying to uh, torment you and, and try to uh, and, and try to uh, yeah, change the game. So uh, we adapted quite well. We kept to our strength, which was our game plan. And I, and I think you saw, well, I, I know that you saw tonight that uh, we, we can back up a really good, efficient uh, kicking game with some really good kick sprint. Finally, obviously, it's a, it's lovely to get the win. It's lovely to be on the board and do it at home, but it's got to be on to next week. It's only one result. Yeah, no, it's only one result, but it's a result that's going to lift yeah. uh, this, this squad. Yeah, it'll lift the, the boys that will come home after their disappointment of this morning. Yeah, they'll see that they'll be on the plane somewhere where they see that we've been four points. Yeah, we go to London Irish, and you know, on the back of what they did today, yeah. uh, you know, they're going to be tough. Everyone's tough here. Yeah. So we just we, we put a, a line in the sand. We set a standard tonight that we need to improve on next week, uh, making sure that we put ourselves in the game to win that game, and then we move out of the competition into Europe. Thanks.